Welcome back. Dixon does it. That's my house. It's an old house and it's leaky. And one way to find out where your leaks are is to do a blower door test. Um, I do this at work and, you know, I can explain it very well. But basically what I'm going to do is take a giant fan, put it in a door, close up all the windows and everything and turn the fan on. And it's going to suck air out of my house. Well, that air has got to get replaced. So every little crack, say like in a window or something, you know, it, it could come in. So if I got a window open or, you know, a crack in the floor or in a wall, you know, like, cause I, I don't have cracks in my walls. Anyways, you know, the air can come through there so I can turn this big giant fan on, start sucking the air out. The air has to come in back in where, you know, wherever it can. And I can go around the house and feel for the drafts and then I can close them up, you know, whether it's caulking them windowsill or you know in some spray foam or something so let's get this set up first step winter conditions close every window close every door and we're going to go through the house opening a door see if our numbers spike you will feel the air if there's a lot of air if you got known issues like in my bathroom there's a hole in the floor going in the basement we're not going to open the bathroom door because that we know that there's heat loss there all the all the wind's going to get sucked up right through there so we're not even going to bother with that. Um, next up, set up your door. There it is. So it's not a door, but it's in a door. And we've got our giant fan and we've got our um, DG here. It's a pressure and flow gauge, but basically it's a manometer. You know, it's for pressure. One set for outside to tell me what's the outside pressure. And this is hooked up to the actual fan, which will tell me the pressure of the air going out and it'll do the calculations to tell me how big the hole is in my house. So it takes all the little tiny holes and adds them all up and says one giant hole. If your house is newer and it's, you know, airtight, you know, then you would want to do it with just a little tiny hole, like take, take the A off, maybe the B if it's a bigger house. Me, I'm just starting with the whole thing wide open wide open all right we're all set up now we're looking for a number Off the bat i felt this window in the pantry which is just um a lot of sunlight but it, it's just a piece of plexiglass over an old window with no glass in it maybe a pane i don't know but i could feel the air coming through there i didn't get any numbers on my dg which means this house is super leaky there's no way i can even like figure that out because you know Usually you could take the numbers and figure things out, but it's so high that it's just ridiculous. So what else did I find? I came through here, I was feeling the windows and the slight draft, but that little keyhole, just lots of air coming out of that keyhole. So maybe we'll just like shove some Play-Doh in there or something. This room, which I'm surprised because the windows are crap. That room was, you know, had some air coming out. This room had nothing coming out. All you got to do is like crack the door a little bit. You just crack the door just a little bit and you'll feel the air coming out. If you open it more and there's still air coming out, that's a really bad room. Um, if you try to open it and it won't open or keep slamming shut, you, you got issues. This room, obviously, the wind door, I mean, that thing, who knows what's going on with that. I mean, we're going to need a lot of felt. We do put big giant curtains over it though, so all the heat from here can go up the curtain, keep that warm heat, you know, the cold air can, you know, migrate its way down into here, whatever. So as long as there's curtains, we're good. My room, oh, my room has a giant crack in the wall. So, you know, when it, on a windy night, you sit here and you just hear this going plop, plop, plop. It's all behind this. I really don't want to know how bad it is, but one of these days, I'm going to have to get at it. That's Lady Dixon's. 
that's not mine. That's a demolition derby trophy. By the way, did you notice that this hall got decorated? This is all needlework from great grandma, the kid's great grandma. This is where the majority of the wind was coming from. That crack right there. Eh, that, that'll get started in the winter when we start working on this room. So yeah, that's what a blower door does. And you can figure out where you need to insulate your house. With all the new regulations coming up in the future where everyone's going to electric and heat pumps and everything, you're gonna wanna insulate your house because a heat pump is not going to warm up an old drafty house. It'll keep it, the pipes from freezing, that's about it. Um, as Dixon does it, peace out. You don't belong over here. Get back over there. Stay over here.